Robot dogs are now ready to transport people around the city. This is not the future, but reality. Suzuki's latest innovation has shocked the transport world by introducing a platform that can adapt and transform, opening up new possibilities for urban mobility. In this video, we will show you robotic dogs that are used in military operations and can be used for patrolling cities, conducting rescue operations, and transporting people. Technology is changing rapidly. Let's take a closer look at them. Spot from Boston Dynamics keeps impressing. After New York City police integrated this robot dog into their operations, other departments across the U.S. followed suit. Now, police forces in Portland, Las Vegas, and Denver are actively testing Spot for real-world use, proving that robotic support units are no longer science fiction. They're part of modern policing. In Portland, the Bureau of Emergency Management began deploying Spot in disaster training scenarios. Outfitted with cameras and sensors, the robot can access dangerous or unstable environments without putting officers or rescue workers at risk. It's already been tested in simulated earthquakes, navigating debris in tight spaces to locate victims or assess structural damage, all while streaming real-time data back to command centers. Las Vegas Metro Police have taken a more tactical approach. Their version of SPOT is used in high-risk situations like active shooter drills and SWAT standoffs. The robot can enter a building ahead of officers, equipped with two-way audio and video feeds. This allows police to assess threats, communicate with suspects, or de-escalate dangerous situations, without sending humans into the unknown. Meanwhile, in Denver, SPOT has been tested by the fire department and bomb squad. Its mobility and durability make it ideal for inspecting suspicious packages or entering areas exposed to hazardous materials. The robot's thermal imaging and payload capabilities allow teams to analyze threats with surgical precision. Each city customizes SPOT's capabilities depending on their specific needs, from reconnaissance to disaster response. And as these departments share their success stories, it's clear that robot dogs are becoming standard tools in public safety. Deep Robotics has introduced a new version of its quadruped robot dog, the Lynx M20. It's the world's first wheeled-legged industrial robot built for extreme environments. The M20 combines four powered wheels with articulated legs, reaching speeds up to 18 kilometers per hour and climbing obstacles up to 80 centimeters high. It's designed for inspection, rescue, and cargo transport in areas too dangerous or hard to reach for people. The robot seamlessly switches between wheeled driving and legged walking. It climbs 25 centimeter stairs continuously and handles single steps up to 80 centimeters. On inclines up to 45 degrees, it stays stable with wheel locking and dynamic posture control. This dual mobility makes it effective on rubble, uneven ground, and in confined spaces. Its leg design helps maintain balance and distribute load during complex movements. Rated IP66, the Lynx M20 is sealed against dust, resistant to heavy rain, and works in shallow water. It operates from minus 20 degrees Celsius to plus 55 degrees Celsius and weighs just 33 kilograms, light enough for one person to carry. Its compact form allows navigation through tunnels, corridors, and narrow technical spaces. The battery provides up to two and a half hours of runtime under full load, supporting missions without frequent recharging. The M20 carries up to 15 kilograms and uses advanced algorithms to adapt its gait and posture to changing terrain. It detects debris, drop-offs, and moving objects in real time, navigating safely even in chaotic environments. It's ideal for inspections at power plants, pipelines, or construction sites without risking human operators. In emergency zones, it can locate survivors or deliver tools, medical kits, and equipment across unstable ground. Suzuki introduced its Mokba at the Japan Mobility Show, a versatile, electric-powered robotic platform designed for urban mobility. The platform utilizes a modular approach, focusing on environments where traditional vehicles are inefficient or impractical. Mokba features four small wheels mounted on robotic legs, each with three joints. These legs are connected to a dual boomerang-shaped frame, which houses both the drive system and modules for various tasks. The platform's modular design allows it to serve as a mobility device, wheelchair, stretcher, robotic arm, or automated cargo rack. Its legs enable it to climb stairs while maintaining a level chassis, ensuring stability in dense urban areas 
or on uneven ground. This feature is essential for environments where traditional wheeled vehicles struggle. Mokba achieves a top speed of 32 km per hour on flat surfaces and offers a range of up to 80 km on a single charge, making it ideal for short to mid-range trips. Powered by an efficient electric battery system, Mokba ensures clean, reliable energy use, though the exact battery capacity details have not been disclosed. The platform weighs about 100 kg, with a length of 1.5 meters, width of 0.8 meters, and height of 1.1 meters. It operates in three modes, chair mode for sitting, standing mode for walking, and stretcher mode for medical use. Each mode enhances the platform's versatility, enabling it to meet a range of needs in medical, logistics, and mobility assistance fields. Designed to provide flexible urban transport solutions, Mokba redefines mobility, prioritizing accessibility, and efficiency for diverse urban applications. At the Osaka Kansai Expo 2025, Kawasaki Heavy Industries revealed Corleo, a four-legged, hydrogen-driven machine operated via balance control. Though it resembles science fiction, Corleo's practical abilities are gaining global interest beyond tech enthusiasts. This robot confidently navigates uneven zones like hills, woods, and rivers, making it ideal when regular vehicles fall short. Because of this, it's being evaluated for roles in military logistics, transporting gear through inaccessible regions, assisting evacuations, and scouting territories. Corleo also shows strong potential in non-military sectors such as search and rescue, adventure travel, and field exploration, showcasing how advanced robotics can serve real-world, high-impact applications. Engineers are already working on expanding Corleo's autonomy, enabling it to make real-time decisions in unknown terrain. Additionally, its hydrogen engine offers an eco-friendly power source, setting a new standard for sustainable robotics. The future of warfare is evolving rapidly, and China is leading the charge with advanced military automation. As the level of robotics integration in combat scenarios grows, Western nations have raised concerns about the potential dominance of artificial intelligence-powered military forces. Recently, new footage from the Airshow China exhibition surfaced, showcasing an autonomous squad of robotic dogs disembarking from transport vehicles and advancing on a mission without direct human intervention. This chilling display of robotic warfare underscores the rapid advancements in China's defense technology sector, pushing the boundaries of battlefield automation. Developed by China Electronics Technology, these robotic units, referred to as robotic wolves, demonstrate cutting-edge artificial intelligence and tactical coordination. The machines autonomously exit their transport, form strategic formations, and execute missions based on operator directives. Some units are even equipped with mounted weapon systems, allowing them to engage in combat, conduct surveillance, and support infantry operations. Their advanced artificial intelligence systems enable real-time decision-making, environmental analysis, and interaction with both humans and other robotic units. The introduction of robotic squads in warfare could reshape military strategies worldwide, raising critical ethical and security questions about the future role of autonomous combatants on the battlefield. Developed by the Turkish defense firm Asilsan, Sarbot is a multifunctional battlefield robot intended for surveillance, firepower assistance, and handling hazardous explosives. Integrating high-level automation with modern tech, it serves as a formidable unit on the front lines. Sarbot offers superb agility, letting it navigate rugged environments with ease. It's built with top-tier observation and guidance tech, including high-definition optics and infrared vision, delivering clear visuals regardless of conditions. Equipped with sensitive detectors and radar, it can sense dangers from afar. This robot clocks a top speed of 25 km per hour on even ground and maintains autonomous operation for up to 8 hours. Weighing approximately 200 kilograms, it carries firearms and grenade systems, allowing it to hit remote targets efficiently. Enhanced armor protects Sarbot against enemy fire and blasts, while smart software lets it chart paths and carry out tasks without needing manual direction. Its artificial intelligence core continuously analyzes terrain and threat data, adapting tactics on the fly. The robot can also transmit live data to command centers, improving situational awareness for troops in the field. 
Chinese robotics company Unitree has released new footage highlighting significant advancements in its quadrupedal robot, B2W. Since its mass production began one year ago, the model has undergone substantial upgrades, making it even more efficient and adaptable to complex environments. The latest demonstration showcases its refined ability to navigate various terrains, improve maneuverability, and enhance structural integrity, allowing for greater endurance in challenging conditions. Unlike traditional wheeled or legged robots, B2W combines both movement styles, giving it a distinct advantage in speed and terrain adaptability. Unitree B2W sets a new benchmark for robotic mobility and functionality, reinforcing the company's dominance in the industry. The robot achieves speeds of up to 6 meters per second, overcomes obstacles up to 40 centimeters high, and ascends stairs with steps between 20 and 25 centimeters. While stationary, it can support loads up to 120 kilograms, and while in motion, it carries over 40 kilograms with ease. Its operational time exceeds 5 hours without cargo, covering more than 20 kilometers, while with a 20 kilogram load, it functions for over 4 hours traveling approximately 15 kilometers. The robot's hybrid locomotion system ensures superior energy efficiency, making it an ideal platform for logistics, defense applications, and hazardous environment exploration. With its continuously evolving capabilities, the B2W is expected to become a crucial tool for industries requiring autonomous, high-mobility robotic solutions. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Please leave a comment with your thoughts on these groundbreaking innovations, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more exciting tech updates. See you soon.